Okay, here we go. All right, guys. So I've had a lot of responses. Or actually, just more views, and people keep watching the uh, Benjamin Prowler uh, .177 caliber air rifle video. So let's take another good look at this, guys. So here we go. So this is the Benjamin Prowler. I got this. If you see my next video, or actually saw my previous video uh, with the Benjamin Prowler. Uh, 1.77 caliber air rifle. I didn't shoot it in that video, but this video is going to be a shooting video. Um, if you want to see any of the specs, I'm not super technical on everything because honestly, you can get everything in the manual. So here is the Benjamin Prowler as the whole package. I have some Daisy 1.77 caliber follow points. So let's just get into this and zoom in let's see like this is if you saw my compound bow video this is not uh, super accurate guesstimations so wherever my camera lies it's on the bottom I already made a group with it earlier but I want you guys to see you know probably about eh, 15 yards let's say 15 20 at best but probably 15 yards with the Benjamin Prowler 1.77 caliber air rifle and we'll see how it groups up so I'll shoot a couple shots for you guys and see how it turns out like I said I shot one above it earlier but that's not important what is important is this next group so here we go shot one Not sure if you guys saw that, but I'll keep shooting. So, next one. Shot two, place it inside the breech. Just for these, you gotta break open. If you guys have never shot an air rifle, this is actually my very, actually second one. I had a BB air rifle, but I don't think that counts. So let's just keep going. Number two. Okay. Number three. And I'm not sure how well you guys can see this, but it seems like it's a group in at this point, maybe an inch apart from one another. But I'm not shooting off any rest. I'm just shooting off, just sitting on my ass. So let's go for the next one. Number three. Okay, that one was like not even a half an inch away from the second shot. And it will go in close to see. So I'll shoot my fourth one. And this has been just rough, Kentucky windage, everything. I'm not doing anything special, just shooting the goddamn thing. Four. Yeah. All right, let's go look at it. All right, let's go walk up on it. So here we are, guys. This is the bottom group right here. This is my first shot. And one, or two, three, and four. So these are more consistent, but like I said, I was shooting not on a rest or anything. I was just sitting down, squat, and this is the top group over here. Um, like I said, about 15 yards, 20 yards. And if I did have more of a stable rest, if I put it on my knee or something, but I just wanted to shoot it offhand and see how when if this is, to me, I think this is actually really acceptable in terms of uh, shooting offhand with a these aren't bullets guys in the state of Florida these are not considered firearms so I'm actually pretty impressed this is actually my first shot with the first grouping before I did this video so it's pretty dope um, and then the rest of these right here one of these had a uh, same hole I forget which one but man I am 
thoroughly impressed with the Benjamin Prowler. So let's go back and look at it real quick because I know I'm probably bleeding video in time and you guys were like, I wanna check this thing out and see what it's worth. So here we are. This is the Benjamin Prowler. And I was just using a uh, simple Daisy 1.77 caliber hollow points that I got from Academy. I got this uh, air rifle from Academy. Great shooting rifle. Um, I've actually been waiting just to shoot a squirrel back here because this is our property. I just want to shoot one, eat one for breakfast, or bring it for lunch. Um, and I've been waiting. So, check it out, guys. This is the Benjamin Prowler 1.77 ca caliber. So, go and check it out. Go and buy one. I got this one on special at Academy. Hopefully, they have them on special because this is a great price I got it for, like 70 bucks. So, this is Max over at Fast Load 456. Peace.